Hi guys! So, for today's video, I'm going to show you my makeup vanity area. And this is all of it. It's just on the top of some drawers. And I have a few things that are not in my HEMA like acrylic makeup storage. So the first one is my Maybelline little pink brow bag. And if you want to see what's inside of this, I will link my old blog post on it down below. So go check that out. Then I have a H&M palette. This is in all this for your beauty. There we go. It just has 36 different eyeshadows. And then over here, I have two little duos of eyeshadow from H&M. This nude one is called Hot Sand. And the purple lilac one, sorry, is called Expose Yourself. These are some of my favorite eyeshadows, but they don't really fit into any of the organizers. So. Let's move into this makeup organizer. Right. Over here, I keep all of my brushes. Some, like this one, is from H&M. I have others from Poundland. They're okay. They're not the best, but then I have some from this Z T I Z brand. And those I've bought at um Poundland in Sweden back home. So they are very nice. And then this one is the same brand. And this is another Poundland one. So those are my face brushes in the first section. Over in this next big section, I have two perfumes by Sephora. The pink one is strawberry, and the like yellowish white one is vanilla. And then I have more random work there. Then in the big section in the front, I keep my uh, Max Factor Face Finity All Day Flawless 3-in-1 Foundation. I have the shade Warm Almond 45. This is not really my shade, it is a shade too dark. But this is the shade I got in a glossy box, so it works. I have an e.l.f. blush in... The shade, hold on, um, Candid Coral, which just looks like that. There we go. There's a swatch. Then I have the Maybelline Fit Me Powder in um, 115 Ivory. And it's just a normal powder with a little puff and a mirror at the bottom. And then I have my e.l.f. Complexion Perfection little, I don't know what you call this. It's a powder. There we go. Then we move on to the three lipstick sections in the middle. Let's sort of separate the two big sections. The first one I have the Simplicity Absolute Matte Lipstick in Destinasi Sinta 2. It's just a warm like blue undertone red color for the lips. So. 
Then I have two H&M lip glosses. This is in pink. And then this one is in nude. And then I have in the other three like lipstick type slots the um, Mini Mani Mo Mess No More Liquid Tape for Perfect Nails and Peel Off Base Coat. This smells horrendous, but it does technically work. Then I have a um, Ocean Femme Makeup Remover um, pen. And I know Elf sells a version of this. So if you can't get a hold of this, then try the Elf one because that's one supposed to be apparently quite good. Then I have a um, nail polish corrector from Kix. This is the same as the makeup remover pen. It has a little tip. And inside of it, in here, is nail polish remover, so you can easily clean up your messed up nails. In this section, I have the Makeup Store um, Easy Cover Concealer in Chai. And that is what that looks like. Then I have a sheer cover. This is the Mineral Foundation with SPF 15 in buff. So that's what that looks like. And then I have a glossy box uh, blush in glossy rosewood. And there is a swatch of that. That is a very nice blush. And then I have a Face Stockholm Highlighter in Symphony. This is a cream highlighter. But then we move on to the second storage thing. I always forget what it's called, but... I know it's a makeup acrylic storage container, but whatever. Um, in this back section, I keep concealers and a highlighter. So the highlighter is this Hema highlighter in, in number 01. This is more like a pinkish highlighter, and it's the... It's a scent. Like a pinkish highlighter with like sparkles in it. Then I have the Ringle, Rimmel Wake Me Up concealer and I have it in the shade 010 Ivory. And I have the Rimmel Match Perfection concealer in 010 Ivory as well. So that's that. Then in this one I keep pens and this one, which is the e.l.f. matte lip colour with all the texture I bought, rubbed off. And this is in the shade Natural, which is just a like natural like pink colour. Mm. There we go. It's not as pink in the swatch as it is in the tube or like the actual packaging but that's okay then I have my eye like light or pens and this PS love brow and wax pencil in I'm not sure if it's medium or brown or something 
yeah. It's an okay brow pencil. I have this Laura Key Eyewear Eye Pencil in Peacock. It's just a blue one. Then I have the Elf Shimmer Eyeliner Pencil in Gunmetal. I have a Starlet All I Want Is Peace, Love and Chocolate Brown Eye Pencil. And the Jelly Pong Pong 2-in-1 Eyeliner in Shadow. And this is in black. Finally in this section I have two of the Essence Long Lasting Lip Liners, which is the twist up ones. I have it in number 01, Ready for Red, and 03, Yummy Berry. And they look like these colours when you swatch them as well. So, hold on. There you go. The bottom one is the red one, and then the top one is the yummy berry one. In this front section, I have the Becca Cream Blush in Hyacinth. Hyacinth? I have no idea. It is a cream blush in a reddish kind of color with a little mirror. I then have a um, cream. This is a Vivishi Ideally a Smoothing and Illuminating Cream for normal to combination skin and it's paraben free. So Let's take that out of the box. Ooh. This is a very, very annoying little box. But that is what that looks like. I then have a um like lip balm. I'm not sure like what this brand is. Yeah, I just keep that there. Then I have the single like eyeshadow from Oriflame in uh, the pure color mono eyeshadow like line, and this is in the sh champagne pearl like color. So that's just the nude. Then I have a Illamasqua um, cream pigment in. Bidaub, maybe? I'm not sure. But it's just a like aqua, maybe teal kind of blue. I'm not sure. Then we move on to the lipstick compartments. First, I have a, a Max Factor Erase Twist Up Concealer. And it's in ivory, I believe, but it's rubbed off. That is what that looks like. I then have a Glossy Box lipstick in Glossy Pink, which looks like that. That is what that looks like. Then I have a L'Oreal um, like, yeah. L'Oreal one is in number 02, My Lady. Then I have a Ayako Liptastic Glossy Lip Pen in Hot Lips, which is one of my favorite, like, twist up balm kind of style. Once there's that one, and then I have another one from Isadora, 
This is called the Twist Up Gloss Stick Moisturizing Lip Filler, number 28, Wine Red. There is what that looks like. This is very moisturizing, I have to say. Then I have a lip gloss from Bella Pierre in uh, Raspberry. And finally, I have this section, which has a makeup store gloss in Princess. A Born Lippy in Strawberry from the Body Shop. A Lip Butter in Blueberry from the Body Shop as well. A Bird's Bees Lemon Butter Cuticle Cream. I have back here a So Susan little... Um, Micronized 8 hour eyeshadow palette. And this was a limited edition one with three shades in it, which looks like that. And then I have four Pierre Rene shadows. And I have a pink one, a silver one, a nude one, and like a reddish, like blush tone. And that is everything for my makeup vanity tour. Hopefully I will do a full makeup collection video sometime in January next year. But we will have to wait and see. I need some better storage for the rest of my makeup collection. So I will see you guys on Sunday again for my next video. Until then, I hope you have a great week and... Bye!